Now there's a lot of things I love in the Metroid franchise. Cool upgrades, amazing environments, strong characters, and epic stories. One of the things I love the most is its soundtrack. The music of the Metroid franchise can evoke a lot of different emotions, from fear, tension, and stress, to serenity, calmness, and adventure. Whether I'm in a car ride, whether I'm studying, or whether I'm making these videos, I just love listening to these tracks. So I thought, hey, why not make a video talking about five of my favorite tracks of all time in the Metroid franchise? Now keep in mind, this is all just my opinion. There may be tracks on this list that you guys don't actually like that much, or there may be tracks I don't even mention that you guys love. Whatever you feel, feel free to leave in the comment section. Just keep in mind, this is my opinion, and this whole video is just based on opinion. So with that being said, Let's queue up that video and roll out that intro. When it comes to raw power, not many tracks can really match up with Lower Norfair. With its powerful bass and its slow chanting, it sometimes feels like this track emanates heat, which makes exploring Lower Norfair much more intense. Why not pick Magmore Caverns or Samus Returns remix since they're just updated versions of this track? I don't know, something about the SNES sound chip just makes it sound better, if that makes any sense. Now to switch things up, let's talk about something a little bit more chilled, both literally and aesthetically. Fedrana Drifts has a very special vibe that really soothes the soul. It sounds like the actual chimes and chants of this song is actually coming from the winds and icicles itself. In a game as scary as Metroid, especially Metroid Prime, I welcome a track that eases the tension even if it's just for a little bit. I don't really remember many tracks from Metro Prime Hunters, but one of the few tracks I do remember is Arcterra's multiplayer track. The beat of this track is really funky and tense, and I'm really surprised that such powerful chanting can come from the DS soundboard. And with the tense vibe, it does fit the mood of a free-for-all hunter battle. Now you can't really beat a classic, and nothing's much more classic and iconic than the original title theme for the original Metroid game. The theme itself kind of symbolizes what Metroid's all about, starting off with a nice atmospheric and eerie tone that makes you feel alien on an unknown world, breaking off into a very uplifting and really adventurous track. You're in a mood to explore, only for the theme to remind you that this is a scary game and goes back to a harsh and hostile theme. That's, that's what Metroid's all about.
Honorable mentions? Basically any track in the Metroid franchise. I love the whole OST, it's freaking great. Now Metro Prime 2 Echoes title theme is one of my favorite tracks of all time. It's something I like to listen to a lot. And I don't know why, maybe it's because of the whole yin and yang that this song kind of has going for it. With the familiar chantings of like the Chozos, or in this case the Luminoth in the background, being interrupted by the much more aggressive guitar, which I guess represent the ing, only for the Luminoth to fight back with much more aggressive chanting. With the whole balance of this song, it's really so cool. I also like how the intro of the song kind of sounds like the heartbeat of the planet, how it's in balance with the light and dark. And I don't know, this song brings me a lot of cool vibes and I just like how it's all orchestrated. But what do you guys think? Do you enjoy some of the tracks I mentioned on this list? Are the others you think should be on this list? Or do you hate the ones I've mentioned? Whatever you think, feel free to leave it in the comment section below. I know the format for this video was a little bit weird since it was mostly about the music, but trying to describe music kind of ruins the whole purpose of music in the first place. So that's why I thought like just short simple descriptions and the rest just being music was just the best way to describe why I like the music. That being said, I'm the Metro Trainer. I hope you like, favorite, and subscribe because I'll be seeing you next time.